put your eggs in one basket. But before you put them in one basket, make sure that you cook them. Why? So that when they break, you can peel them and eat. And don't put all your eggs. No, no, I, I encourage you to put all your eggs in one basket. But if you attempt to put them in one basket, cook them. So when they break, you can enjoy them by peeling them to eat. But remember, once you cook them, their lifespan of preservation is limited as compared to when they are not cooked. So put all your eggs in one basket or put some of your eggs in a small basket. But cook them. So when they break, you can divide and put pepper inside and eat. You don't regret. So you meet a man who is gently coming from America. The wife is in America here and there. Are most people who are married to their wives in America do be our dear flu, our dear flu. One of the most boring things that I've ever come across on earth is marriage. Very boring. Especially when you have too much instructions and the environment is not conducive and enjoying for the partners. When the spouses don't have the freedom of being an individual in the relationship, it becomes boring and stinking. When you marry early, you will regret till you die. There is an age for marriage. Any woman who marries before 29 will always regret in marriage. Any man who marries before 30 years will always regret in marriage. Oh, hear me. You can be angry. I don't care about it. If anybody tells you that age is just a number, they are fooling you. There is age for marriage. There is age for building skills. There is age for becoming what? If Zion Felix, I hear Zion Felix, somebody says he's just 32 years. 32 years boy has the right to get married after 30. If a man marries after 30, he's sensible. So when you start making babies after 30, you see, people come and bluff and they tell us, eh, 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 I have, I have, I'm so excited that even though I'm now 30 years, I have a child who is also 15 years. I mean, Jimmy. I mean, don't make us feel as if you've not regretted. And, I, and right now, I, I, I look at me, I am 42, and I have a son who is 20 years. I mean, stop the Jimmy. You, know. you want to tell me that when you were 20, you had a child, you were happy? You want to say you're happy about that? No, when mistakes come, we've not spoken about the mistakes, baby mummies. No, that one is there's another package. But I'm saying, there are people that genuinely, they were having sexual intercourse with men. Who they didn't know the men were married. And by virtue of the activities that were surrounding them, they assume a position as a shadow wife. And when people become shadow wives, they expect to be treated as such. And by virtue of being a shadow wife, wives produce babies. Because it is good for you to be a wife before becoming a mother. Yes, it is an ideal situation. But if you don't get it, it doesn't mean you should die in a dying relationship. When a man is not responsible for you, don't die there. Move on. Don't stay in marriage because of the children. Don't say, I don't want to have children here, they're here. No, 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 no. Have children here and there. And at the end of the day, one of them will produce the best father. Don't live with me alone. I'm, look, you have three children with me. You have spent nine years of your life. Ten years of your life. Zero. There's nothing you can hold on to. And you are fortunate I've not married you. It's a shame you have children with me. And anytime you discuss marriage, I throw it away. Do you know how painful it is? Where you find yourself with a man, you tell the man, go and marry you. And he asks you that. Hey, you have a man you are asking for marriage in a bro just sent you there me ba bro chi won dwen hwe won be sample say be bia me do say say be new be ya crata ma me ana de bia sorry ah da me na wa be hu papa no da me na be hu ma me no i mean dem kra na pese me ye o me nya wo dem bi bi ya me ti me hu nto me i mean yes yeah here the silly thing they are telling you if a man can keep you waiting for you to be waiting upon so that he comes to marry you it means that you you are not presentable you are not marketable. Nobody else is interested in you. My sister, hear me. Dress well. Look good. Smell good. Get your body in shape. 
wear a nice dress i'm not saying expose what you have but make sure that what you have will carry a meaning out there walk out there go to an event go to a restaurant go to a church walk there as a baby mama so that somebody else will be attracted to you to marry you don't die for a stupid man who have a child with you look at the pictures of minnelli look at it just look at the pictures of Minalin. She had Minalin pictures. Very beautiful girl. Very, very beautiful girl. It doesn't mean that uh, 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 Zion Felix is ugly. No, 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 no. But I'm just looking at the girl Minalin. That if truly speaking, even now that she has a baby, she wants to move on in life. She can position herself to attract another man with babies that will be better than the life of Zion Felix. We move ahead. We don't come back. Yanko yechi. Wow, why is he getting better? Yanko tinko tia se si ya unam sa abia akwebia ne sa hand to mouth. Mami, me suti abiru chire. Wa bre sa ato fio wa Ghana. Upo biya wale na. She se wa mfa se si kia me wari Jimmy ni be me duho. Ebe ye se obe tawa wa di su abe baby obe tu amane di uye. And Pema grow or your solid. Men tnaha and me far branch be a fin when your diabetes and the quarter so you're not from Zia. Now they are being pipe, but me some pipe on my brand new book. Oh, yeah, Bema Bea Wedjuma. Oh, yeah, Bema or what's he can be a Bia Bema and the quarter genus so when he be Janajo. I'll bet to you, my dear Uncle Pansy. Na yem ye kata ya boni su. Na yem ye da homa yen shira. Enti fa wa sem ni na shenisa. Na yem ye da su. Oni ne ya to nyo. Eze be manu po oni di ye di. When do yem we fi. Obi kruti mi be di ma to nyo mse. Na yem ye kata ya boni su. Eze akwana ri yom we fi. Oh hima. Se ina nyanko pombo mi. Enye sa nanya me bo me. Enye sa nanya me bo me. O ye yi. E fri yi. E fri yi. E fri yi. Enye sa nanya me bo wo. Aba wai. Bo wai. E fri yi. E fri yi. Enye sa nanya me. There was something that missed. So you can become a baby mama by virtue of assuming yourself as a wife with a man. Like the way I said. I come to US and I come and then make one, two, three with a certain lady, and I don't tell her I am married. So she assumed that there is a space. Oh, that's it. Or as you say, a point woman. Now she takes a chair. Oh, that's it. Oh, Tnasi, what the atmosphere? Now, and maybe it's me, Jack, and I say, Momo, yeah, he. Minu zewe shiye bidana. Wa bet na siya mani mwa ye hi. There are some side chicks that they are so troublesome than wives. If you are a man, pa, and you are not fortunate. Hmm. If you are a man, eh, and you are not fortunate, and you miss such demonic attack oriented side chicks, ube uwe jwa ukuru oyele. Omu jiwa, na ma jiwa boso. I will show you how to be a side chick next two weeks before our show on 26th of September. I will show you. Because if you don't really know how to be a side chick, you will cause yourself to lose the man and all of you will become... So people become pregnant for men based on what they are hearing in their mouth. Your... The guy you are going out with comes to look at you and says, Son, I'll call at you. I mean, me name the basis here. What before you know your bath is here? What? Hey, but she said, Me baba for skin color. We tell you things. But when you get pregnant, then we are angry. Oh, yes. We tell you things. But when you are pregnant, all of a sudden, hey, where they say, Koi. So there are reasons why people get pregnant for people. Some make silly mistakes. Because they don't know how to investigate behind the man. When a man tells you, I am not married, what can you do? Who do you go to ask? Yes, yes, no, no, no. Let 
let's be fair. Me, I like fair things. As I end my show for today, when I tell you I am not married, where will you cross check and see I'm lying or I'm speaking the truth? Where can you go to my family house? The first question they will ask you that then I'll be sir. Yeah. That's the first question. Ah, why are you asking say why are they? God bless you too. No, you want to know whether he's married, so that what? You see what will happen to you? So because of that thing, crown go be sample say why are now. So me fear brutia bagana. Me buy and me see fear no abet nemu. Obi ani ho. Ena me be pay. Na me obet na ose makotina brutia. Awari bi ani pa ye di ye krat awari. Afin na me bagana abet po bi awale no. When a man tells you this, and your request is to meet a man who you love and he cares for you, well, if you are brutia but he cares for you, you assume a shadow wife position. Let me encourage you. Stop that. And yet, when a man leaves America and comes to Ghana, UK, Germany, Italy, and comes to Ghana looking for a wife, don't live with them. Hello? Men to end kotanani ho. A dear be a no woody and so if you have to cheer, but woman, then this I shall not bear. Yeah, shall for this car. Men, my name, but my name, my wound, jay, dear, what yans no buy it. All back gun and a near and true within born a quotiano. Don't assume that position. Memo, baby, in fee US M, but and I'm at not at check. And I'm a show within when we say, baby, I yet do a woman say, yeah, now pay a wound that that time I would GSS. Everyone puts a one worry here, be seeing it. It's a man, I'm by dear. Messiah Musa and Paso be a new one now. Namin just a quam best on the first so Namin no Babruch, the TME, Obi do Babruch, and Unchrawa do Obi Tigana or Pabruchiraba Naka come back first with your bar abruchri and to do whom the man is say Yan Walimian Brabruchira or no baby abruchri no yan crata or be jow and yan bonny a yan son Obi Troy as a monkey's play by sizes. So check your side before you start playing. Nanaya says, let me read Nanaya's message. Hmm. These are the true talks that makes human happy and free. But our pastors will not teach us and will force you into prison sentence called marriage. It's true. I will not doubt it. It's true. Me, 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 me. My marriage for many years is solid because immediately I discovered the truth. Everything that they told me in counseling, I abolish it. I'm telling you, me and my wife, what we are practicing was not what we were told in counseling. No, 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 no. That is why I talk like the way I talk. I'm saying that me and my wife, if what I'm talking about today was put in us. We will get married, but we will not go and do wedlock. My wife is there. We will go and do missus and mister. Yes, that's the truth. Because the rings between the two of us is not what is proving our life. Yes. I love my wife like a crazy human being. She's the first thing that will happen to me in everything. My children are not the first. My wife is the first. And everybody knows. If I have money for my children, and my wife is broke, I will stab my children and give it to my wife. Or I will do it. That one, I don't care. Yes. Because I have brought somebody's daughter to come and stay with me. I always tell you, when you see my wife, the way she looks, one outside, she will easily be picked for a relationship. And the people can marry her and change her destiny. Give her better things than what I'm giving her now. I agree. Yes. So I'm careful. But I'm saying that this marriage thing, to be a born one and move on with your life. All you need to do is to come back to that level and make it clear to yourself. Make it clear to yourself. Let it be understood that, what does they say? Counselor, things like the Dubai King. We need more of counselors. We need more of counselor in Ghana and Africa. So 
we can transform Ghana. Don't worry. There are more coming like me. You need a tough skin to be like me. Pa, tell you the truth. And you're easy. And you're easy to be like me. I don't even know this is how the Dubai king thinks. I don't know about it, cry. It's not you writing it. Thank you very much, Kenneth. I don't know this how the Dubai king, I don't know her mind. Maintain a necrat and Marco Moon in mind the poor cancer or being. But Kenneth, my son says that's how the Dubai king thinks. Bless you for that information. God bless you too. God bless you too, my son. God bless you so much, class prefect. I'm saying that I'm wrapping up in the next 20 minutes. My time is up and I'm going. Thank you for being part of my show today. Remember that this particular segment of our show was brought to you by... You can hear the sound of what I'm showing. It's nothing but it's ginger honey chips. Ginger honey chips. Now in the United States of America. Everywhere you want. 862-215-2008. You can chill like this, or better still, put it on your cocoa, rice water, oatmeal. You can put it in me, Akwadashi. Your whiskey, your brandy, anything you want to put it on it. It's so nice. <laughs> so nice, nice, nice. <laughs> oh my God. Ginger honey chips, 862. Two and five two zero zero seven eight six two two and five two zero zero seven is your ginger honey chips. Get one for yourself. Thank you very much. Get one. Regret having the ginger honey chips for yourself. Eight six two seven. I am grateful to their support and also grateful to A2 TV as I bring the short one end today. I want you to understand the we have been kept in the dark with fear. Thank you, counselor. Yes, yes, yes. As of that one, we all know. The reason why we've been kept in the dark Thank you very much. Thank you so much. God bless you that I'm talking to you. I'm very happy I'm talking to you as well. Today I'm doing well in reading the messages, and that is why you need to find something for me. What must here? Oh, I'm rich. I know I send him a zero. Kakra, I'm the affair. A dinner chair or UBB. I like a beggar. Yes, he a man in power. Yes, he a man. But say me di kakra. So I'm going to say Ghana beggar. Nigeria correct. Where did be that? Who be Ghana be di beggar? One shabby fit. Franchise no match. Gen beggar king. Franchise no baller. Or Ghana. The beggar king in Ghana is baller. The KFC in Ghana is baller. If it's franchise they are practicing with, then somebody should tell them what they are doing in Ghana is baller. Almost ton and no man buy my ass chicken. A franchise there, we should have the same thing. Who did beggar waha? Who feel it? Who win them? Who did beggar? Who corner got to KFC beggar now? We are. They said the old Obika. Now they bought the thing thing. You can't look at. And you say so be a juma. If it's franchise, we should enjoy the same thing. Who a person me top beggar fear bro chile bro say me fear send me scan. Make two hundred dollar the end back one bro. Uh, Twenty dollar crown, make you hundred dollar. They are top beggar, bro. I'm ready. Now do you have a feeling? Where Philip passed away, they are brutal beggar. Me da masipai. They are sending me back to top beggar. I mean, do you why? Me me beggar na sa. Me da grow for me send me as me da as. Ah, this boy can't sell it to us. Crab, we have power. I say Frank Frankie's Frankie's beggar is very nice, counselor. Bibi, I'll because of that, I'll buy you beggar. I'll buy you beggar king from the US when I'm coming. When you finish eating. You see that the Frankie's beggar is nothing. And your beggar no more, no. Cheese in the crown, yeah, there. Then your master ma walk and then call him. So let me wrap up today. And Ruru, I greet you wherever you are. Join me before I wrap up. Now hear me here, please. Still, still unable to reach you. Oh, where is he on Facebook? Check the link. The link is there. I've pasted the link, my sister. If on Facebook, I've pasted the link there. Let me paste the link again for you. If you want to reach me, just click on the link. Once you click on the link, straight you will come. It's there. Just go and find it. It's there. I've clicked. I've, I've just posted a link. Can you see it? Can you see the link? I posted a link. Go and see the link. See the link. If you are watching me live on Facebook, see the link. Click on the link and you'll be part of the show. The link is there. Very nice. Thank you very much. So as I do my forward march and link up today. Now watch it, my friends. Most of us, have gotten to a point in our lives where we want to throw in the towel. We have become stagnant. 
The story of your baby mamaship is the reason why you are becoming slow in your life. Hear my story. Move on. Move on. Move on. Have a decision to marry again. Have a decision to become a wife. If you become a wife today and it doesn't work, break it. Look for opportunity again, become a wife. Don't stay and become just a baby daddy without having a wife. Try marriage and see. If it doesn't work, break it. Try again. If it doesn't work, break it. Try again. If it doesn't work, break it and try again. Don't stay in a dying relationship because of your children. So somebody's husband comes to lie to you. I am single. Not just that. There are times that people have children for men whose marriages are on the rocks. They are contemplating divorce. The documentation has not been cleared. Listen to me. This thing I'm wearing here eh, is one of the painful things that can ever happen to you when you want to divorce. Especially if you have developed things together like the way I'm doing with my wife. Where every asset, every property, everything you do is together. Divorce comes and there should be a sharing. If there are children, it's 75, 25. If there are no children, it's 50, 50. I'm saying that when you are together and you are going for divorce, it's painful, but it's necessary. Divorce is not a sin. God has never said anywhere that you can't divorce. So there are a lot of people who are going through the phase of divorce. They are in separation. I don't want to marry you again. And whilst the woman keeps preaching, I don't want to marry you again. The man now finds himself wants to marry. And that is why he came to have a relationship with you. So he didn't lie to you. He told you that he has a problem with the wife. The fact that I tell you I have a problem with my wife doesn't make you a shadow wife. I am telling you something that nobody will tell you. So that your regret of having a child with me will change. I didn't take advantage of you. I didn't take advantage of you. If I'm in US and you want to contact me, my sister, I write it for you. It's 862. So that's what you're looking for. Okay. So you can reach me on WhatsApp. On 862-862-571-3950. Is there a scrolling on my system? The 862-571-3950. You can call me on WhatsApp direct. Call me on that WhatsApp line when I finish the show, my sister, and I'll help you. Or is it my brother, John? Is it John? Okay, John. John, you can call me on that WhatsApp line and I'll talk to you. Okay, Naomi Adams, thank you for coming. Patient Atta, thank you for coming. My number is what I've pasted there. You can also join me on the link direct. But as for the things I've pasted, you can enjoy it. Thank you very much. So it's there. Thank you very much, Nana. And, 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 and I'm happy you are still with me. My contact is there. I've dropped it down for you. And the emojis are there. My contact for you. You can call me direct. 862-571-3950. Let me wrap up for today's discussion. So there are women who become pregnant because the man was going through marital challenge. So their relationship was hanging. And once they become at the TLC in the life of the man, they assume by themselves and the utterances of the man that they are shadow wives. All of a sudden, they begin to produce babies. And there are times that their ages, where they find their age, baby making is real, is very close for them to have a child. And once they feel comfortable with you, they want to have a child with you. When they have children in that particular jurisdictional dispudency, don't ever assume they are fools. Don't assume they are weak. Don't assume that they are not the type of people you can live with. It is not a mistake. It is a deliberate, conscious effort of moving forward. And all of a sudden, something broke them. The man wanted you to be there until the wife will live. But let me tell you one of the good things. If any man wants to break up with the wife to come and marry, you never agree. If a man breaks up with a wife because of you and they marry you, you will suffer in their hands. So don't do that. 
Baby mama, hear my story. So the way you became pregnant and had a child is the reason. The man impregnated you. He came to America and was having fun. All of a sudden, he got you pregnant. And after getting you pregnant in America, he has kept you in America. The wife, where he has a child in America, the family is not aware he has a child in America. Only some few friends know you have a child in America. Can you shut up in America? Shut up. Shut up. And I want to come to Ghana. And my child wants to come and see the other children in Ghana. Shut up. Me say, shut up. And I'm going on social media. It's the baby of my son. And, and uh, let your son know I am the father. It's okay. Don't hide me. I said, don't hide me as a father of the child. Let the child know I am the father. I'll keep on chatting with you on WhatsApp. I'll keep on doing video call with you on WhatsApp. When you call me and the environment is not conducive, I will not pick it. You are fortunate you are in America. 911 works. So I am not your emergency exit. I have a child with you in America. I have a child with you in France. I have a child with you in this particular country. Yes. Don't ask me silly questions. Is your wife aware you have a child here? So what? So that what will happen to my wife? If my wife gets to know you have a child here for me, what will he do? Will he send you juju in the air? I want to come to Ghana to come and visit my parents. But when I come, I don't know where to live. You can't come and live in my house. Baby mama. Your position is not a wife. And the fact that I have a child with you in America, I am doing all my necessary things in giving you $400 every week. $200 every week. $1,000 every month. I am doing my position. The children don't pay fees. But that money is to keep you small, small going. If I didn't come to impregnate you, you were sleeping somewhere already. So just assume the position that I can only rent for you as a wife or rent for my child under the law. Don't tell me you are making my life miserable. The next time I see a young lady walking, I will not come and impregnate her. Stop the fooling. Stop the fooling. Making my life miserable, what will you get? I am responsible for that child. Announcing to the world I am the father of the child will not help people take care of the child for you. The child should know I am the father. I came to America married. And you know I am married. I never promise you that I'm going to stop with my wife and marry you. Any man that tells you I'm stopping with my wife to marry you is a wicked man that will stop with you to marry somebody else. So the way you have the child doesn't give you the preeminence to dilute your lifestyle. The fact that I have a child with you in America doesn't stop you from having sex with other men. I'm not married to you. I have not bought your vagina. Don't come to Ghana and come and demand sex. You know the environment in Ghana. When you come to Ghana, I cannot have time for you. So don't come and put pressure on me in Ghana. And I'm going to have six weeks. You know why? When you were in America, the time difference was okay for me. Look at the time right now in Ghana. What is the time in Ghana? It is 11.20 in Ghana. What is the time in America? It is 6.7. 20 in, in America. So you see, you are in 720 in the evening. I can talk to you at the time because at this time, where it is just evening, it's more, it's, it's, the time is good for you so we can chat. When you come to Ghana and it is 11 together, we all sleep at 11. I sacrifice to talk to you. So follow me with a child in Ghana to come and make noise in Ghana. Does it make you wise or foolish? I'm not saying don't come to Ghana. Immediately you come to Ghana, and you bring my child to Ghana to come and know Ghana, I agree. My family might not be aware I have a child in America, in UK, anywhere. They don't know I have had a child with anybody, even in the Fijasi, in Kumasi, whatever. Stop pushing yourself to be known. I have not forced you. 
to stay for me. I have not asked you not to have sex with anybody else. It is your choice that you took a decision that I'm the only person you want to have sex with. That's okay. I am married. We have problems in our marriage. My wife has moved to the father's house, but the marriage is still there. So why do you behave like this as a baby mama? Don't disgrace yourself. Let people know that there's a man in your life who is responsible. Bam. And a child every day will wake up in the morning and he's putting pressure on me. I have missed daddy. I want to see daddy. So you are calling me 6 a.m. in my house. Are you stupid? You call my phone. I didn't pick. You send me a WhatsApp. I didn't respond. You send me a telegram. I didn't mind you. Then you call the landline that you know that the landline my wife will pick. When my house is on fire, what do you enjoy? You post our child on Facebook. What do you get from it? You open a page for our child in America. What do you get? Even people in America, they are living in the same house and documentary-wise, they don't prove that they are married. They don't take pictures together. I come and visit you in America and, and we are, can I have a shot with you? Can I have a shot? The next minute, the picture we took is on Instagram. I can visit my baby. You take a picture and you are excited. Yes. But what you have, you are a shadow wife in your mind. This is what. This is why till today you can't get anybody to marry you. Because your position you have assumed is delaying you. The process by which you became a baby mama is what will determine how you can marry again. Friend, friend, I don't think the ending of my section today is making you happy. But as I wrap up today, the way you become a baby mama is very essential. I will call you. I'm in Alaska. Rebecca, thank you very much for calling me. You have said it all, Councillor Luto. Thank you very much for joining me. Uh, speak up. I'm speaking up and wrapping up. Naomi says, a lot of women are afraid and scared to move on, to move on. Their confidence level is very weak. I encourage you to encourage yourself. Marry now. I say, move on and marry. If you assume a position that you don't want to marry, but you want to patch with me, then learn how to patch as a baby mama. Don't create troubles. Don't ever dream in a wedding gown. That one day, I will come and wear a wedding gown with you and walk you at, on the aisle to go and say, I, Counselor Lutrot, do take you as my lawful wedded wife to love and to hold till death do us part. Shut up. It won't happen. But if that is what you want, keep my child, but look for a better man to marry you. Never use my child as an excuse why no man wants to marry you. Never do it. Don't make the child the excuse why no man can come into your life. I told you, I have a very sweet girl. She's so sweet and so nice. Unfortunately for her in America, anytime she wants to call me, she wants to call me on video. She will call me on WhatsApp. She wants video for me to see her. She's very beautiful. But the problem she has is that she has a child. Every time she calls me on Facebook, the child will appear. Hey, uncle. Uncle, I'm fine. How are you, uncle? Am I talking to the child? Everywhere you want to go with her, the child wants to follow. The child has become like a handbag. You can't have a relationship with her. And because of that, it's as if everywhere she goes, the baby daddy is following. Because the child goes to the baby daddy's place to go and spend Tuesday to Friday and comes back to Tuesday. Anytime the child daddy have a chat with the child. So who came to mommy? Silly talk. Don't make your life centered around my child. 
if you want to hang in there for me forever, if you want to remain there as my baby mama, and you made the choice to have sex with me after having the child for me, then be careful the way you behave because you have taken a position not to move on. Never tell people I'm the reason and never curse me. And never think that after you, I won't get somebody else. Because some of you, your problem is that you don't want to, eh, I don't want to hear once again that eh, you have a child with me in America and before I hear, there's another child again. I may have a child with you in New York. I want a child in Maryland. I want a child in Virginia. I want a child in Alaska. I want a child in UK. I want a child in Canada. Will you want to mortify force yourself and multiply yourself that you become the vagina in UK, vagina in Canada? Is that what you want to do? Can you be happy with yourself if you assume a position not to move on to marry, but want to be my baby mama so that you continue enjoying the love you share with me? Can you shut up and manage yourself as a baby mama and stop fighting other people? Oh yes, now everybody knows I have a child with you. But the way you are managing yourself in America, you are putting yourself in a problem where you cannot manage it. Some of you can go to the stand of introducing yourself to my wife. Oh, madam, you don't know me. <laughs> you don't know me. You don't know me. But one day you will know me. I greet you. You are very beautiful. You have a good husband. Then you come and leave this memory in the mind of my wife. All too soon we come for holidays. Then they see you in the picture. Then they remember, ah, this girl. Five years time, they don't have a child with you. Then my wife will begin to say, ah, ah. what is that? You are a baby mama. Stop assuming position as a wife. So you can become a wife to somebody else. So people get pregnant by lies. And at times, what you call lies are true. The men are telling you the truth. There are some people that they are not married. They have children in America. The marriage they are in is marriage of convenience for documentation. Yes, yeah, so they come to Ghana and say, me wale yo, me wale ya, me wama for. And once you bring them to America, and they come and see that baby mama, they come and fight the baby mama. Are you serious? We are serious. I mean, that will never happen to me. Oh. Yes, we have documentary marriage. You me, I even tell people that that my, my wife. Well, I don't know why you should have a chance to see that woman cry that had a documentary marriage with. Once you have a child with a woman, that child and the mother will always be in the life that you are living. If you have a child with a man until you die, he will always be in the picture with you, even when you marry the president of the Republic of Ghana or you marry the president of a particular country once i have a child with you i have a say in the life of the child and because of that there is some impartation be careful what you say about me so the way you become pregnant will give you the action to move on or to keep on staying to stay as a baby mama or stay or move on as a wife my friend today you've done well you stayed with me in this number of hours marry 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 thank you very much instagram marry if you are not ready to marry but you want to pet with me behave behave i don't think your behavior is keeping me up you are frustrating somebody's husband what lesson do you want to teach him? No man is stupid to sleep with people like you. So the Canadian Japan's baby mama. I don't think honorable Canadian Japan is stupid to have sex with you. So stop fooling. Stop disgracing your daughter. If you are a qualified woman, somebody should marry you by now. But you see how it goes like. So the way you become a baby mama will determine your way forward. Tomorrow, I'll bring onto your way the next page. People become baby mamas not because of all the things I've said, but because of divorce. That will be the next page tomorrow. Move on. Move on.
Don't marry him because of the child. Move on. But if you want to stay with him because of the child, be ready to be a second wife. Be ready to be a shadow wife. And by so doing, you can become a wife as a born one. Thank you very much once again. I'm honored you joined me. I didn't get anybody on the link today to come and have a conversation with me. But tomorrow is another time. I know by God's grace tomorrow, we might have a bigger time, an earlier time. Today, I came late because of technical hitches. But tomorrow, I promise you, I'll come earlier than you expect. Tomorrow, we're doing us, we'll start the lecture from 7 p.m. in Ghana time, 3 p.m. in U.S. time. Be part of me. As you support my brand, support whatever I do. Please, the numbers are scrolling down there. To my foundation, the numbers are there. Those of you who want to sell ginger cheese for me, the numbers are there. Please give me that support that I deserve. And I will never fail you. I'll continue teaching you what is right. I appreciate you so much. I appreciate you so much for staying with me. Stick and stay with me the next time you see me here. Subscribe to my YouTube channel by going to YouTube and press the bell, Counselor Lutrot. Follow me on Instagram, Counselor Lutrot. Right now, as you're watching me on Facebook, just follow the button. So when I come, you can always have the alert. Thank you very much, Josephine. Thank you too for coming. Thank you, Yaya. Thank you, Jemima. Thank you. Thank you so much for joining me, Germany. Thank you very much for coming. Bibi, I love you so much. I love you so much. Thank you for being part. God bless you too. And before I wrap up, remember. So nice, nice, nice. <laughs> oh my God. Ginger honey chips. 862-215-2007. 862-215-2007. It's your ginger honey chips. Get one for yourself. $10. Free to go. Enjoy yourself. Thank you. Well, a big thank you to Ginger Honey Chips for their able support. They've done so well for me and I'm excited. Let me say a big thank you to A2 TV for their technical support and their management. Today, unfortunately, we miss Ruru. We're not able to get Ruru, but I believe that tomorrow we'll be able to get her so that she'll become part of our, our show. God bless all of you for being part of me. I've been your counselor. Counselor, get the if you are hearing me today and you want to work on yourself to become a wife or you want to know how to manage yourself as a baby mama, even if you have a child and you're already married, you can always call me 862-571-3950. Let me give you the number again, 862-571-571-393950. So 862 571 3950. You can call me on WhatsApp. And once you call me on WhatsApp, I'll be ready to pick your call. Call me on WhatsApp. On WhatsApp. Call me on WhatsApp. Call me on WhatsApp. And I'm ready to listen to you. God through counseling. I'm working. I'm ready to put your life back to shape. God bless you. Thank you so much. Let me see a big thank you to Akosia. Let me see a big thank you to Bismarck. Thank you to all of you. Join me again on the same channel at the same time and let's enjoy ourselves. God bless you. Thank you. Till I see you again, it's yours truly, Salah George Lutrot, and it is me. It is a me. It is not a Lutrot. Baby mamas never regret having a child with a man. No matter how useless the man will look, be proud that you are a mother. Be proud that you are a mother. Good night. Good evening. And remember, on 26th day of September, African House, 670 South, 21st Street, Everton, New Jersey. On the 26th day of September, 4 p.m. sharp, our relationship show called CIC. 
chats in the chamber is coming on and i promise you this is the first show in america and it's happening the first show in new jersey tell a friend to tell a friend that is happening live at african house 670 south 21st street everything new jersey what well, test place we all know of our test place let's all meet there 4 p.m sharp on 26 and we are treating why married why still single why are you married why are you still single remember this has been my agenda for many years let's understand why we are married let's understand why we are still single but one but two let's have a discussion in-laws let's have a discussion sex life let's have a discussion and remember this particular show that is coming up on 26 is probably brought to you by Vicro 20 a plus shipping don't forget that a2 tv is ably supporting us don's production is also there with us and your ginger honey chips the best of the best if you want to sell ginger honey chips in any part of the united states of america call 862-215-2007 if you want to sell in ghana send a whatsapp to 0277-609-644 i am out of here thank you very much good night God bless you. Let me go on Instagram. God bless you for always teaching us the way to peace of mind. Thank you very much, my sister, Mavis. God bless you to Mavis for coming. You can talk to me after all this talk. If you don't come in with a personal request, it will become a difficult thing for me. God bless all of you. And I'll see you again, my dear. Love you. I love your picture. God bless you so much. I'm wrapping up. There's a call. I don't know if you want to go live. Do you want to go live or you want to talk to me personally? Privately. Okay, so let me finish my show and call me in the next 10 minutes. Okay. I'm just ending up. Thank you so much, my dear. Okay, okay. So there's a private call coming in. I thought she wants to go live. Thank you very much. The number again to call me on Instagram is 862-571-3950. I am out of here. God bless you. Till I see you again. God bless you. Your whiskey. Your brandy. Anything you want to put it on it, it's so nice, <laughs> so nice, nice, nice. <laughs> oh my god, ginger honey chips 862-215-2007. Is your ginger honey chips? Get one for yourself, ten dollars, free to go. Enjoy yourself. Thank you. I hope you can hear the sound of what I'm chewing. It's nothing but it's ginger honey chips. Ginger honey chips. Now in the United States of America. Everywhere you want. 862-215-2007. You can chew it like this. Or better still, put it on your cocoa, rice water, oatmeal, you can put it in me, Akwadashi. Your whiskey, your brandy, anything you want to put it on it. It's so nice. <laughs> so nice, nice, nice. <laughs> oh my God. Ginger honey chips. 862-215-2007. 862-215-2007. It's your ginger honey chips. Get one for yourself. Ten dollars, free to go. Enjoy yourself. Thank you. <laughs> I hope you can hear the sound of what I'm chewing. It's nothing but it's ginger honey chips. Ginger honey chips. Now in the United States of America, everywhere you want, 862-215-2007. You can chew it like this, or better still, put it on your cocoa, rice water, 
oatmeal? You can bring it in me, Akwadashi. Your whiskey, your brandy, anything you want to put it on it. It's so nice. <laughs> so nice, nice, nice. <laughs> oh my God. Ginger honey chips, 862 215 862-215-2007 is your ginger honey chips. Get one for yourself. $10, free to go. Enjoy yourself. Thank you.